In the early and quiet morning in the countryside, when the sun has not risen, there are green palm leaves scattered on the ground. There are bamboo branches snipped into little pieces. They are thin and long. There are carts filled with all sorts of things, especially pointy shaped hats. All of the hats are made of young bamboo and palm leaves. These pointy hats are called nanla. Nanla is very important to Vietnamese culture, especially Vietnamese women who wear nanla with aoyai. It is a common sight in Vietnam. People also wear nanla to protect them from the hot sun. The materials to make nanla are bamboo, palm leaves, and a sewing kit. Palm trees grow in the northern Midland province and the Phu Tao province of Vietnam. Bamboo grows in the forests in southeastern Vietnam and in the central highlands. Many people believe that the Nan La or conical hat became popular and was widely used in the Trung dynasty in the 13th century. The Nan La has been part of Vietnam for a long time. If there is no Nan La, farmers and tourists will be disappointed. There are a few problems that the Nan La industry is facing. One threat to the Nan La is that the makers are not getting paid enough. People who sell Nan La only get $1.50, so young Nan La makers are going to the city to get better jobs. Another problem is that people who come to visit Vietnam mostly buy hats from big brands like Adidas. People do not buy Nan La because there are other hats to buy. I think we can sustain uh, Nong La <laughs> for, um, for a long time because the Nong La is the uh, beautiful symbol of uh, Vietnam. As Vietnam becomes a more popular travel destination, more Nong La are getting sold as souvenirs. If this continues, it will help Nan La to be sustained. Also, the big brands in Vietnam can help the sustainability of the Nan La by selling them along with other big brand hats. These big brands could even put a logo on a Nan La. Then, when people visit Vietnam, they will see the logo and buy Nan La. Additionally, big brands should try to work together with local hat makers to help with advertising so the local Manonla makers can get recognized. Then they might earn more money. Now, Nanla can be sustained. Mm -hmm.